Well, g'day everyone, and welcome to another episode of BlankCanvasTV.com. We're changing the way you see and experience art. My name's Andre Knott, I'm your host, and today I'm down in the Caribbean. My goodness, I'm excited. It is a great day out in port because Wow, I got this amazing life, I gotta tell you, I travel all around the world and I get all these wonderful shots and on BlankCanvasTV.com right here, we talk to some of the big uh, art collectors around the place and people I've come to know uh, along my travels as an art dealer and uh, we're down in St. Croix today, St. Croix, one of the beautiful US Virgin Islands and uh, just across the way over here is St. Thomas and just over this way is St. John's and uh, Tortola's up the road as well if you like and uh, it's just magnificent and today we're going to talk to uh, David Fidelis. David Fidelis is a, an art collector. He's been collecting over the last few years. He's got an amazing art collection up in New York City, but he's also got a fantastic art collection down here in the Caribbean in St. Croix. And I just want to show you a little bit about his collection today. But uh, before we do, get a look at, out over here. Isn't this an amazing picturesque setting? Isn't this somewhere you'd like to live? David's also a real estate agent, so you might even see him online. Check him out at David Fidelis. Uh, type him in, and uh, in fact, we'll talk to him in a minute about that but uh, we're gonna go in there right he's got even got the, the American flag flying up there isn't that fun I'll tell you we're gonna go in and say hello to him right now uh, come follow me and uh, we're gonna talk about a bit about his art collection David you're out I'm here <laughs> hey Andre good, day, good to see you how are you nice to see you Very Come on in. To, can we go in there okay right. it's superb I'll tell you, uh, we got a fantastic art collection. I, I, I wanted to be able to show your art to uh, the viewers right here. Uh, David, this is the first time you're on Blank Canvas TV. It is, yes. Yeah. We, we'll probably uh, maybe even visit you up in New York City when we get a moment. I hope so. Have a look at your art collection. Great, that's yeah, yeah. great. Very, very good. But uh, David, is, like I said, he's been buying works of art with me over the last uh, few years. And it was great to actually be have the opportunity to come down today, say good day, and uh, have a look around the island. Beautiful place, got to tell you. But also has beautiful artwork as well, and the local art that you can acquire right here. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, exactly. I know a lot of what you've actually collected in your home right here uh, is local feel, local art. All yeah. local Caribbean artists, all of them from Saint Croix. Why is it that you've gone for the local feel here? Do you think? Because of their spectacular colors, spectacular vistas. All of which is, is, is canvassed very well. Right, okay. And uh, I mean, is, is it because you're supporting the local art community? or That is it too, and I really like it. I think it fits the style of this home, and it's just a it's a super collection for the for the style of life we have here. I think so too, and I, I think, I mean, New York City, your, your apartment up there, I've seen photographs of that. Right. I can't wait to come visit in the West Village. It's going to be fantastic. Great. And uh, I'll show the viewers as well your collection there. Okay. But I mean, the works of Urte and the Art Deco type field you've got there in New York City kind of might be a little lost right down yeah, here. Yeah, it wouldn't work here at all. Wouldn't no. work. Uh, but I'll tell you what you have got here does work fantastically, and let's go have a look at some of them, yeah? Sure, happy to. Well, why don't we come over here first of all. This, this work right here uh, seems to be, well, it's, it's got a, a myriad of uh, kind of images in one right here. Exactly. I mean, and it, it's the way, this is Maria Henley, yes. and it is the way she paints. Uh -huh. And this is exactly my office photo okay, so, from here. So <laughs> this, it, is this, it is that view of right. Great Pond on uh -huh. the South Shore that Maria captured here in art in a sunrise. Isn't that incredible? Or, excuse me, that's probably a sunset. Sunset. Mm -hmm. And so you've got this uh, this beautiful feel, and you've got another work by, it's Maria Henley. Yeah, Maria right? Henley, yes. Yeah, and Maria Henley is still painting on the island, is she? No, unfortunately she's passed away, so this has become a rather valuable piece. Yes, yeah, so we don't talk about those morbid things, do we? Yes. <laughs> 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 Let's have a look a bit around the, uh, around the place right here. What's the dog's name? That's Sophie. G'day Sophie, how are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. This piece I was very uh, excited about when I saw it. I mean, it's got it's got texture, it's very tangible as right. well. And uh, I mean, you can have a look at this and uh, and, and just, what what is this all about? This is literally a paper mache uh -huh. tree yep. created by uh, one of the students from Good Hope School where I serve on the Board of Trustees. Okay, and so this was... I mean, you, we, we just a local piece. I fell in love with it. It was very interesting. Was it a charitable donation? Piece? It was a charitable do donation piece. Yes, right. and I thought it was just a great, uh, just a great look and a this, fun piece. This doesn't look like mache to me. It looks like a canvas that's been rolled up and kind of all bunched yeah. up. Is that is that what it is? You know, you may be right. I, I think it is. Yeah, I think you may be right. So you've got canvas with on, on top of the canvas. Mm -hmm. it's something very, very different. I've never seen anything and like it. It's a that wonderful before. look of a tree. Uh -huh. you know, those are a couple of trees together. I like it very much. This piece over here. This is Pam Kirshner, yes. and 
when I picked you up at the seaplane, we actually went by there. That's Fort Christian Vern, right uh -huh. downtown. Uh -huh. And we went by this spot. I think it's great. It's great of the colors, as well as the arches and the shadowing is terrific. What I love about the island here of St. Croix as well, as we're driving through the town, is that it hasn't got the hustle and bustle of some of the other it's Caribbean islands. It's a very islands. quiet, it's a very quiet place. Beautiful community. I tell yeah. you what, if you get, can have a chance to get down here and see what it's like, I'll tell you what, it's just wonderful. How long have you lived here? 22 years. 22 years. And, and you Selling real estate, doing that thing. Um, what, what is your website there? Fidelis.com. That's F-E-D-E-L-E-S.com. It's great. Go and check it out and uh, David can show you some wonderful real estate in the area. Uh, there's also, uh, gee, I love this piece right here. Is this, what is this from? That's, from, that's from my friend Julie. She yeah. just gave me that. Uh huh. Yeah, I just kind of think it's an interesting, it's an interesting. Uh, it is very interesting, yeah. isn't it? But have a look at some of these artworks across the side here as well. Another Maria Henley. Another Maria South Henley. Shore as well. Yeah. Similar view. Don't the colors work so wonderful. well? Wonderful. Really wonderful. They really do. And Jean Merwin. Jean she's Merwin. one of my favorites. She's, she's a, unfortunately also passed away, uh -huh. but a beautiful self taught painter. Right. Wonderful gingerbread concepts, fun colors. Really super. I have a couple of her pieces as well. I think the beautiful thing about this, what we see down in the Caribbean, the art right here, is the colour within the pieces. I mean, exactly. it does tend to sing. I mean, your decor around the house right on top of the wall is very yeah. Your yeah. decor is very very colourful as well. Almost like uh, a lot of the, the houses over in Russia. Have you seen? No, I have. I well, maybe some in Saint Petersburg. Saint Petersburg. Yeah. That's what I'm getting at. Oh yeah, yeah this looks very colourful colour, that yeah. way. These are the other two I wanted to have a look at right here before we uh, do. Uh, sign off this here. is Phyllis Bill. Uh -huh. She's the actually the art teacher at Good Hope School, mm -hmm. and I think that's a wonderful, sassy West Indian woman selling her wares, her produce downtown. Very much so. Very and fun. I, you really do get the feel that you're right there on the street with them, don't you? Exactly. Very impressionist kind of yeah. brush strokes. Very fun, wide brush strokes. It's great. Uh huh. And this one. And this is Jean Merwin again. Jean Merwin. Mm -hmm. This is 1999. You had this for years. Yes, I have. Yeah. Yeah. I've collected her through the ages. Very good. But she looks great here in the kitchen. You mean through the ages? <laughs> <laughs> You're not that old, eh? That's right. No, I'm no, no. It's great to see you again. Thank you, good Thank to you see for you coming too. on the Thank show, you, Andre. I appreciate it. Make sure you check out the uh, real estate down here in St. Croix. I'm happy and, to help. Yeah, absolutely. And I want to thank everyone for tuning in right here. Leave your comments if you'd like to be on the show as well. You're an artist, you're a, or you're an art gallery owner, no, no matter who you are. I'd love to have you on the show right here. Just contact me right there on the website. We'll make sure you're there. We're changing the way you see and experience art. Great to see you again. I'm Andre, and I'll uh, see you in the next episode.